So where is God when we suffer? The way Lutherans understand this is through something we call the theology of the cross, or the theology of the cross, uh, which is all about the, the cross you see behind me, with the cross for Christians, all Christians, is a symbol of Jesus' death and resurrection, and therefore new life and the power of, of God's love. But what happened to Jesus on the cross, right, was this moment of pure suffering. So Jesus suffered, he felt alone, he felt abandoned, even abandoned by God. He was abandoned by many of his disciples. Very few stayed with him at the cross. So at this moment on the cross for Jesus was this pure moment of suffering, pain, loneliness, abandonment. And so Martin Luther looked at that and said, you know, when we ask, where is God when we suffer? Our answer is, God is here. Because in the suffering of Jesus, God knows exactly what we're going through. No matter what it is that we're suffering from or with or for, God knows it. God has experienced it. Jesus even called out to God, you know, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? Jesus even experienced that sense of distance and abandonment from God. And so when, when people ask me, like, where is God in this? Why did, why did God let this happen? I say, well, God is right here. That's why Jesus went to the cross, to find us in our own suffering and to be within us in our own suffering and to draw life out of death, to draw life out of the death or the loss or the pain or the suffering that we are experiencing. And this is the theology of the cross. God is with us in our suffering, and God is always bringing life out of death.